right, welcome back. It is time for Trending Tuesday, sponsored by our good friends at Elm City Market. That's right. We went there this morning, picked up the ingredients, and today we are making a spring berry salad with poppy seed dressing, fitting for today. Yes. Of course, the weather. It is calling for a nice spring salad. And we have some wonderful ingredients right here. Very simple. Super fresh. Take things out, add a little more, whatever. You can customize it to your liking. Here are the ingredients that you will need. Yeah, we need half a cup of poppy dressing, which we uh, bought at Elm City Market. Then we'll need a cup, a quarter cup of pecans toasted, three cups of salad greens, two ounces of goat cheese, crumbled, and a quarter cup of dried cranberries. All right, and the first thing that you are going to do after you also get a cup of strawberries, half a cup, half a cup of blueberries, and then you need the protein calling for six ounces of chicken breast and this can be grilled it can be breaded whatever you like yes. we have one option today with grilled and we have one option with breaded yeah very easy you really just throw this all together. it's simple really the longest portion of this is obviously cooking the chicken if you choose to do that you can also get it pre-portioned at elm city market yeah. they do that for you make our job easier but if you're going to take the uh the wholesome route. You're going to cook the chicken. <laughs> Start that first. We're going to pull up the directions on screen here for you so you could just take a quick look at what the uh, in directions are once you start. So cook that chicken, prepare the dressing in the meantime, then you add the pecans and uh, toast, you toss it occasionally, then you put the lettuce into a plate or bowl, and then you put all the chopped up um, Let's fruits. put it this way, it's a salad, just throw everything in the yes. bowl and mix it up that's and right. that's it. Those so are the official directions. <laughs> that's the official it's directions. It's easy enough. All right, so let's just add the chicken. We're going with the chicken in right here. So again, this one's breaded, mm -hmm. and the nice thing is, as Natasha was just saying, sure, that could be what takes the longest when you're preparing preparing this for lunch, yes. for dinner, but if you do want to go to Elm City, they can do this for you. Yes. Even, you know, chopping up the strawberries, which this is a half a cup, yep. that can take some time as well, but you can just get them pre-sliced. Right. And oh, you know what, no. chicken? I'm making it more dramatic than it needs to be. Chicken's quick, so really, <laughs> it is quick. all in all, this probably wouldn't take you more than 20 minutes to do. I'm an air fryer queen. I have I have had my air fryer since Christmas, and I still haven't used it. We were talking I about know, this. I know, so you just pop it in. We need to do an air fryer <laughs> segment here to hold me accountable. But <laughs> anyway, let's put in the blueberries here. We, we have a quarter cup of blueberries. Toss that in. It's already looking nice and colorful. All of these antioxidants between the Very strawberries and the blueberries. Berries. Yep. And then we have the dried cranberries too that adds a little more sweetness to the salad. We'll put that in. This is quarter cup as well. You need the crunch. You need You're that little crunch. Pecan, Speaking right? of crunch, yeah. We have now here's a question. Do you say pecan or pecan? I say pecan. I say pecan. Yeah, pe pecan. Pecan. I mean, I it sounds fancy. fancy. <laughs> You say pecan, but I guess we're not fancy. <laughs> I'm going with the pecans. Okay, pecans, and then let's we add end that at the end, the right? Cheese. So we don't mush we it up. Put it on top. That's a good idea, actually. Let's go with the dressing. Okay. So the dressing that they provided us is sugar-free. It's the poppy yes. seed. I always try to go for a sugar-free dressing. Obviously, yeah. you have to read the labels because sometimes a sugar-free can mean that all these added things right. are in it. But these dressings can be loaded with so much sugar, so much fat, so it's so important that you're really paying attention. It is. Because if you're putting a terrible dressing on a salad, it it's sort of, it's thing. taking away the health I know, this is not one of those. This is a delicious one. They requires half a cup. We're not gonna measure it out today because everyone has their own preference, right, on My dressing. husband, the lettuce Drenches. drowns. I'm kinda like that too. In the <laughs> dressing. So you guys, when you have a salad at home, you measure Separate. separately? Separate. Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll do a nice balanced approach here. I won't have my heavy hand as per usual. I think that looks good. <laughs> Mixing it all up and then we'll go in and add the cheese. Yes. Smells delicious, looks Oops, delicious. I'm this is great blueberries to everywhere. bring if you're asked to bring, you know, something to a party, so to good. a cookout. Great option. And then we this finish goat, with that cheese goat cheese on top. Yeah. Bada bing, bada boom. Perfect. You got protein, you got crunch, you got healthy fats. Yes, you do. There's a lot going on. And there's the finished product as well, in case Beautiful. you can't see with this. So just an idea, especially in the nice weather. I know I'm digging into this after the show. Oh, I can't wait. We will have this posted on our website. If you want to make it for yourself, WTNH.com. We'll be right back.